Yeah, dude. Dude, I didn't even know you had one on your neck. I like how you said like yeah. Welcome back to a amazing episode of Hot Seat. Today we have in the hot seat, Mr. Subin Choi. Oi! Hey. Subin, Subin, Subin. So uh, in case you're not familiar with how these episodes go, we're just gonna ask you some increasingly hot questions. Oh, we're gonna shit. start with a very cold question from Bart. Take it away. If you had to stuff caterpillars into themselves, mm -hmm. how many do you think you can fit into one? <laughs> Realistically, five. Like wow. a Russian doll? <laughs> like a Russian doll of cat caterpillar? Yeah, but one has to fit like into the other one perfectly. Like, like five. five of them? That's five. a lot. Perfectly? Yeah. Five anyway. <laughs> Two caterpillars like fit another caterpillar. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of caterpillars. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, some God, fucking five. phenom, yeah, dude? Yeah. Caterpillar stuff and phenom? <laughs> what gives you so much confidence? You just said five like that. You didn't even think about yeah. it. Um, well, first of all, they're squishy, so you shove one in, but make sure the one that's outside is in a nice little layer of hard layer. Tape them around, open it up, squish them. Tape them around. <laughs> tape them around. <laughs> that just sounds like tape them around, open them up. The one that's going in, yeah, just shove five in there. That just feels, that just sounds like I'm playing with my foreskin. <laughs> But same idea, same idea, same idea. It's like you're hey, stuffing a force tribe. cave. Yeah. Same tribe. I, I have that, so I know. <laughs> I have that, so I know. <laughs> so it's definitely possible. What's it like uh, having your foreskin still? Yeah. You a fan of it? Did oh. you wish it was a five skin? Damn. No, I wish it was cut, to be honest. Really? Even yeah. now? Even now? Not now. But when you're growing up. But when I was growing up, everyone's like, yo, what the fuck is that? I was like, what the fuck? That's what? how I felt. <laughs> yeah, I begged my parents to get surgery because I wanted to be normal like the other boys. I did too. But then I realized that it's probably not a good idea. Well, in elementary, like back in my days. Why is everyone looking at your dick though? Well, because back in my days, they had a, pee, you know, when you use the restroom, it was, a, it was one of those Bro. trenches. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The trough. I, I tell everybody this, we all pee together. Yes. And then, but no one remembers this. I remember no it now, did. yeah, yeah. You guys yeah. did it? Other people look at me like you didn't do this as a kid. No, yeah, we all just trenches. We all look, yeah. what well, are you guys playing baseball today? Ba uh, basketball? And everyone's like, yo, why is your look like that? I was like, I don't know what the fuck mine look like this. Yeah. I'm just born like this. You never had that where it's like everyone, everyone's like, oh, I have to pee, and like I have to pee too, and then you have like five boys going into one stall, fucking peeing surround together. and peeing together. Like, yes. Someone can understand yeah. you. You did that too. Yeah, I, see, this is the fucking thing. <laughs> but our, dude, our brains were, we weren't even thinking like it's gay. Yeah, we're, we're just no, pure. You no, know, we're just I like, like yeah, everybody. You, had, you guys are not out yet. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, man. We just haven't came out. <laughs> Not even that. What are you talking about? We're just like, we're peeing together. Hell yeah. Let's go back to class. <laughs> you just wanted to do everything together. Yeah. yeah. It's just the homie shit. If we could shit together and like talk and hold hands and we like should. while we're all sh like if all there was no doors, right? If boys could just <laughs> sit next to each other and, I'm, yeah. and, and hold hands like this and shit. Found his limit. Yeah. I think we would have. Because pooping is you time though, right? Well, I didn't mind probably like staring at each other pooping when we were younger. But I don't know about the holding hands. No, like <laughs> all in a group like this, all like holding hands like this. One, two, three, and then squeeze together. You don't think so? Pinch them yeah. off. All right. <laughs> I would have done it. I, yeah. Great. So five caterpillars, huh? Man, people were looking at me like I'm, <laughs> I'm crazy. Like, like we didn't pee together. I thought every... Boy in elementary school peed with their friends. Yeah, yeah I this, did. One, this one did. And yeah. Bart did too? I did too, yeah. You no, know what I mean? None of my uh, schools. I remember vividly, like me and all my friends, we're probably like maybe seven or eight, watching Baywatch and then like sitting in my living room and they're like, oh, I think my dick's swollen. What about yours? Like, oh, I think my dick's swollen too. Is it swollen like mine? And we're like, squeeze each other's dick. Like, <laughs> you got boners from watching like Baywatch and shit. And we're like, yeah. oh, fuck. And we're like, Oh, we should go pee, cause then we like let's go pee with swollen dicks, <laughs> and then we're all just pissing at the back of the toilet, <laughs> and not even into the water. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cause you didn't know how to control it yet. Yeah, cause you're trying to force force it, and you're like, oh shit, and everyone's dicks pointing upwards. Yeah, yeah. You're just like, what's happening? When did you lose your virginity? Thirteen. Oh shit. What was that like? What's the story? And what was his name? <laughs> her name. Her name. 
her. So he he identified as a her, huh? No, it was a her. Her name was Jeffrey? She... No, it was this, uh, I forgot, uh, I don't even know her It was name. a Samoan man. You don't know her, her name, name anymore? No, I do. I, oh, do. I was like, what the? <laughs> <laughs> it was a he's, Samoan he's man. Married, yeah. He's married, so he's taking it easy right yeah, now. You know what I'm saying? It was, it was a chick, Filipino chick in Hawaii. Everybody was oh, Filipino. Oh, good. Congrats. We did it in her dad's, uh, bed. Wow. Dad's whoa. bed? Yeah, her dad's whoa. bed. Oh, wow. We are doing it, and I was like, whoa, this feels crazy. I was like, this is nice, you know? <laughs> but I didn't know how to <laughs> act. Oh, you know? bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bro, this is kind of good, huh? It's slippery. <laughs> but it was cool. That was my first time. Yeah? My first time. Who taught you to, how did you know what you were doing? It was natural. Oh. If you think about it. Like, you guys were just making out, and then... Yeah, yeah, the first time I, uh, I figured out about coming, was because my grandpa would have been in his room smoking cigarettes, watching porn with a vibrator. <laughs> <laughs> what oh, the fuck? No, yeah. No, <laughs> That's yeah. fucking crazy. Holy yeah, shit. and I look at my grandpa like, yo, what the fuck are you doing? You know, obviously in Korean, but I was like, yo, what are you doing? And he was just like, oh, oh. Oh, you, oh, he wasn't doing it publicly. You oh. caught him. Yeah, I caught him. And he I thought he was like in the living room, just like chilling. No, he was in his bed every day. And I was like, yo, what are you doing? Wait, He's like, what, what kind of... <laughs> what kind of <laughs> so one day he what went... What kind of vibrator is a cord? It's a cord. It was the most... Oh, oh, the one. The one. The, the, one. the, the cord. The ones, the ones yeah, at Brookstone. Yeah, I'm telling you. Old school yeah. ones. And I was like, yo, one day my grandpa left and I was like, hmm. <laughs> What's like going on I'm here? the captain And I was like, oh, <laughs> shit. And I nutted, but nothing came out. Oh. Yeah. Till the like six months. Like, till the last... The next it's crap. Came out and I was like, what the G. fuck? I don't know yeah. any I don't know anyone that smokes cigarettes and jacks off at the same time. That is <laughs> some gangster shit. What a legend. When we had cable, I forgot what channel it was like 999 or some old the last channel was always porn. <laughs> yeah. The last channel. Yeah, but then for my lady, it was just like you know when you rub dick on their butt, you're like, oh. Doing. <laughs> <laughs> Is it time? <laughs> Is this what my friends were talking about? Is it time? That's when I was like, let me, oh. <laughs> That's when I first found out. Are you more, uh, are you more Sacramento or are you more Hawaii? Hawaii, baby. All the way? All the way. How, how old were you when you moved uh, from Hawaii? 15. You went as your whole family? Just, yeah, Just my you. whole family was me and my, uh, your my brother, brother and my mom. mom. Yeah. We we're stuck in this one room at someone's house. Why? Why did you guys move to Saka Tomatoes? Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. My mom one day woke us up from my pastor's house. This is when we got evicted. We got at pastor's house, and she's like, "Pack your shit." And I was like, "What the fuck's going on? Just pack your shit. We gotta go." And I was like, "What?" So she just grabbed us. Didn't tell us where we were going. She just drove us to the airport. Damn. Yeah, and then we're in the plane. I'm in shorts. Jackie, as soon as we land, Sacramento was snowing. I mean, not snowing, but it was hailing. No way. Just you and your brother? Me and my, me and my brother and my mom. Oh. Our auntie's picking us up, and this is where we gotta stay. And I was like, yo, mom, if we're staying in fucking Idaho or somewhere <laughs> with cows and shit, I'm piercing my whole ears and I'm gauging it. The whole time he's thinking about piercing his ears. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's that? I need permission. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's anything? Yeah, because everybody, dude, that's all that's on his mind. Oh, wow, I just want to pierce my ears and shit. Hawaii, the Filipinos were like gauged oh. up, quest crew hair, middle piercing. <laughs> quest crew hair. Everyone had vans and stuff, but so on the way to um, our home in Sacramento, I see cows. And I'm like, Mom, I told you, if this is where we're staying, I'm piercing my ears. And you got them pierced in... I gauged uh, it. In Sacramento? Sacramento. That's crazy that... Were you like, were finally! <laughs> I could be free! <laughs> <laughs> I could be myself! Yeah, but just to realize the Hawaii swag in Sacramento looked whack. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Looked so... Sacramento was just like... Because now you, you stand out, you're yeah. unrecognizable, no one knows what the hell you're trying it to do. It only works during the summer. Cause in the winter you can't be too Hawaii swag. You can't. That's why I was like, whoa, what is this? Cause it was yeah. USC. Uh, it was just like a college sweatshirt with short pants and Vans. That was a swag. And I was like, yo, what is this? This is lame. <laughs> Everyone was dressed like that. True religions, Converse, and I was like, dang, I'm the minority in the school now. Wow. Well, they didn't look at you and be like, what's that? That's so cool. No, they say you from Hawaii? Did you surf hut to hut? And I was like. Holy cow, these That's kind of are, funny, bro. No, that's kind of funny. I was like, these fools are serious. <laughs> Did you swim? 
from hut to hut. Do you drink <laughs> coconut? <laughs> Kids are mean, bro. <laughs> That's what I said. What kind of Asian are you? And I was like, what kind of What is this? I was like, mom, I'm tattooing myself. <laughs> <laughs> like, no, you're not. And I was like, where's dad? And dad didn't do anything. Then everyone started wearing diamond swag. And I was like, yo, where do I get these outfits? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did you ever talk to your dad about why he bounced? Uh, no, because I knew from my cousin. But when he w he called you, no Facebook. You How are you? He typed it. <laughs> How are you doing? How are you? Was his pic Facebook picture like this? His Facebook picture is it's a no user. It's just oh. a girl. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. oh yeah, those. So he said, "Are you taking care of mom?" I was like, "Who the fuck is this?" He said, "I'm your dad." I was like, "Oh shit." How are you? <laughs> so what, what What? did you find out from your cousin? Oh, so my cousin called me three years ago. He said, yo, you know the reason your dad left was because he got chipped by a lawyer saying you're gonna get your citizenship, so I need about $10,000. And back then it's a lot. <clears throat> it's 2008, 2007. Yeah. yeah, still a lot. 2008, 2007, that's when the whole market crashed too. You yeah. could have got citizenship for way less than that. Yeah, but my dad hopped over Canada to Washington. Mm -hmm. I was like, why the fuck did you do that, dad? How did he end up in Hawaii? He he flew Washington to Hawaii. To Hawaii. Yeah. <clears throat> but the, the lawyer said I could get you a citizenship for 10 Gs. But really, because he knew his situation, because you came over illegally, you couldn't have gotten it. But the lawyer was wow. playing him. Wow. So the so lawyer just took so the much. money, they took the money and said, peace out. And that's the first time I ever see my dad cry on the phone to the bank. Yo, give me my money back. And I'm looking at my dad like, you bitch. <laughs> why are you crying? But I didn't know at that time. Yeah. Damn. Holy yeah. shit. So why did he go to Korea? Because he had nowhere else to live or he couldn't face his family? All his money was gone yeah. from Hawaii. Wow. So he had no choice. And then the market crashed and so everything was shit. Yeah. Business went down. He had nothing left. So he wanted to go to Korea to make money. To come back? To come back, but never could, could never. How come, he, how come he didn't take the whole family with him? I don't know, man. That's what I'm saying. I was like, yo, what the hell happened? But I'm glad he didn't. This life is better here. It is weird though. I feel like a lot of Asian dads, the way they solve problems is by themselves. Yeah. yeah. It's not like we're a unit. So if I'm going here. through this together, the whole unit moves. It's like, I gotta go solve this. Yeah. And then I think and you create a bigger problem. <laughs> <laughs> nah, no, dude. Yeah. Failed I, hella hard. I thought that was an Asian dad thing. I just realized we had fucking shitty dads. Yeah, no. Cause solid Asian dads, are they, they know how to solve shit with their families. Like we just had, Deadbeat dads. Yeah, yeah, he just dipped. That they didn't know how to solve shit in general. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, that's what I, because I see other people's families and they don't fuck. They're not as stupid as our dads. <laughs> no, they're not. I'm no. like, yo, you're. But I did the same fucking shit. Our dad's Asian. You should all should have been smarter. <laughs> what the no. fuck is this? But we're, they're like the losers of Asians. Like, they're not, they weren't the fucking actual mover. Like, our dads are. Doctors and politicians and like top level people. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like they're like they didn't make it. They had a fucking you know what I mean? Like they didn't. Yeah. That's what happened. Yeah. I don't know. That's just my take on it. Cause I'm like, every all of us have the same story with stupid ass problem solvers. They don't know how to fucking solve shit. They're like they make up stupid reasons. You know, it's like yeah. just running away. Mm. Less less weight on them. Mm. How did your mom cope with like Raising you and, and uh, by herself, just drinking. Just would, drinking? No, she no. She would she would have to go work like what do you call it, nonstop. But she was always figuring out how. Like that's why we moved to Sacramento because my mom was like, "Yo, can you get us a job? Can uh, to her best friend? Can you get us a job? And then we'll start our life from there." Hmm. So we moved to California, Sacramento, and then my auntie gave her a job, but the my auntie's business got broken into. So they had to file bankruptcy, so my mom damn. was like, damn, we gotta go somewhere else. Which her best friend was in LA. In LA, you could get a job anywhere. So my mom was, uh, moved to LA, but we didn't move to LA at that time. So you guys stayed in Sacramento? We stayed in Sacramento. Were you already older? Or? Yeah, I was already 16, 17, but... So you stayed with like family friends? I stayed with my homie that I was dancing with, their family, which was Mexicans. It was cool, staying with the Mexican families. I was like, this is cool, because the Mexican family had a dad, only a dad, not the mom. Really? Where was so the mom at? 
The mom was somewhere else, so they were switching spots all the time. Oh. So I was like, this is cool. At least they're in the same area switching spots. Oh, like they're, were they together or they're just like working and then... No, just baby daddy stuff. With oh, okay, okay. But the dad was cool because he was Thai, raised with Mexicans. Whoa. So the, the Thai, yeah. <laughs> What the, the fuck? fuck? This is America, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is going on? My whole life was a trip. So my my homie's dad, which I call him dad to this day. Oh, that's dope. Took me in, but he was he only knew a bunch of Mexicans, like ex Nordanios and all of that. So he's a Thai guy that uh, not married, but had a kid with a Mexican lady. Mm -hmm. So your buddy was half Thai, half Mexican. Half Thai, half Mexican. And then you stayed with their family. The mom at first and something crazy happened and then yeah. I moved in with the dad. Dad didn't want me at first because like, I teased him about his toilet. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> <laughs> the toilet is shit. You need, a, you need to clean that shit up. <laughs> you know you're under my house. And I, I think about it, I'm like, damn. That's fucked up. But was it really a shitty toilet? Was it a broken toilet? <laughs> it was just a toilet flood all the time. I was like, God Was damn. it dirty? Yeah. You gotta stink uh, that thing, dude. I was like, I can't even take a shit. This is a problem. And he was like, hey, this is my fucking what Never a, insult a man's toilet. What a ever, thing to tease ever. somebody with. Yeah. And, and, and for them to be so mad about. Yeah, <laughs> to be angry. Yeah. That toilet, <laughs> that's my toilet. He was mad because he was insecure. He's like, God damn it. Yeah, so my buddy comes to me, he's like, yo, my dad don't like you because you, you tease his toilets. <laughs> <laughs> toilets? I was like, he only has one. <laughs> <laughs> Still going. <laughs> How's your relationship with their dad now? Cool, I guess. I don't really, I mean, I talk to him here and there, but every once in six months. Is that something you're trying to repair? No. Or like just, it's just the way it is, or? Well, now that I heard the story, I'm cool with him. I'm just like, hey, dad. Hey, what are you doing? Cutting hair. That's all you're going to do? And then I just leave it unread. <laughs> like, don't tell me what to do. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm going to leave it unread. But yeah, that's yeah. funny. I know, like, who's he to tell you? Yeah, I mean, at this point, that's the crazy part. I'm not really close to my dad anymore. Like, even when my grandma, and grandpa died, I didn't really. There was no emotion. Yeah, yeah. It's you know what I'm dude. saying? You didn't yeah, save I your grandpa's that, vibrator. <laughs> that's why I bought one. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, your jack off grandpa was his dad? Uh, my mom's dad. Okay, but that are you close to those grandparents? Traditional life. I I, I was I was yeah. till they passed away from butt cancer. Ah, uh, butt way. cancer. You should have played with his booty more. <laughs> butt cancer. That's what he calls that. Anal cancer? You could get butt cancer? Damn, yeah. that's crazy. I didn't know that. Yeah, I didn't know shit. <laughs> I didn't know shit, man. Wasn't dick kind of cancer though, that's for sure. Just growing up, trying to survive, you know? Yeah. That's so all now it was. that, cause, cause Suba's really like <laughs> jacking off great. He, he's very, I would say, super dependable just as a person. Yeah. What traits do you want to have as a dad when you have a kid? Like, what's most important to you? When I have a kid? Yeah. Just culture, just respect. You know, stuff like that, just, I feel like if you just teach them respect and culture, that kid can go far. Mm. Like the way you, you you make fun of your friend's dad's toilet? Yeah. But That's what? why I'm teaching him culture, man. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be nice, don't say some dumb yeah. stuff like that. <laughs> but what's, which culture are you gonna center more on? Because you're with, because uh, his wife is Russian, right? Russian Jewish, yeah. Russian Jewish, yeah. Mm -hmm. So what's the household gonna be more of? Probably gonna be under her. Sick, you're gonna be Jewish? You're gonna get connected, bro. My kid is. Yeah, yeah. that's gonna be tough. It doesn't work like that. Cause that's a bigger no, like, leg up than being because Korean. it's coming out of a Jewish lady. It's oh, considered yeah. Jewish. Cause I thought that like the Jewish is connected through the mom, so the mom has to be Jewish to be Jewish culture. Yeah, but technically, yeah, technically I can't still. You still can't. I still. Oh. I don't know what I gotta do, but if I do, they probably gotta chop off the. Oh. oh shit. Let's chop the foreskin. Yeah. You know what I mean? But um, my kid is. <laughs> but, hey, my kid's gonna be, so I'm gonna try to send him to Jewish school and be like, yeah, be friends yeah. with all of them. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You better get in the movie industry, dude. Come on. Yeah. yeah that's so I can do my stunts. Yeah. <laughs> no, so I can just chill. I'm on a yard. <laughs> I'm on a yard and a dog. My lady, that's it. That's tight. That's your future. You wanna you watch your watch your lady garden while the dog runs around. Yep, the birds. That's peaceful. With my AR nice. next to me, I'm like, yeah, <laughs> oh. buddy. <laughs> Just like this, right here. So you wanna be in Tennessee? 
Nah. Oh yeah. Where, where do you Hawaii. Want, where do you want to ultimate? With the AR, they're not gonna let you have that. Huh? You can't have an AR in Hawaii though, right? Yeah, you can. You can have all. Yeah. You can have any guns you want in AR in Hawaii. Yeah. It's just harder to get. It's harder to yeah. get. It's like you California. gotta check in all yeah. the time with HPD. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Who's got the hottest question, Nick? How'd you meet your wife? Instagram. She hit me up first. Oh. We're supposed to just be, you know. <laughs> what did she say? What was her introduction? <laughs> can you teach me how to break dance? And I was like, I sure can. <laughs> <laughs> it was supposed to be just this. <laughs> we're, supposed to be, we're supposed to be just this, but you know, seven years in now, and we're married. Fell in love. Oh, that's so dope. Fell in love. Yeah. Oh, yeah that's awesome. Like, it just happened. She grew up here? She grew up here. Oh, uh, Ukraine, okay. Israel, here. Wow. She's really cool. She's she's an awesome tattoo, tattoo artist. artist. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah. In Hollywood. Yeah. She's great. Did she do some work on you? My whole back. Can I see? Show your back. End it with your back. Yeah, dude. Dude. I didn't even know you had one on your neck. Like, you said, like, yeah. <laughs> wow. 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 Hi. Snake and a what? Tiger? <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa. You, whoa. A snake around a tiger? Uh, it's a Royal Rumble. It's a snake, tiger, and a... What is it? You <laughs> Dragon! Yeah, what's back there? Tiger and... Uh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> oh, eagle, it's like eagle, 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 yeah. eagle, 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 eagle. It's like a griffin. My it's bad, like a griffin. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Subin, Joy!